they ban and then uh oh. so this is did he go Fox or Marth? He did Marth. Marth versus all of Marth. What? I think Marth definitely wins this because all of his Pikmin just going click a forward tilt. Right. <laughs> oh that talk is right up my nose. Alright, let's see how this match goes. Apparently last time they played, it was really close, but Death pulled it out. Yeah. Uh, I hate playing against Marth. This is Luigi main, it's just it's hard because Marth's speed with his sword and just his range, it's just bad. Yeah, he's just yeah. constantly running away from you when you're trying to get in with your wave dash and your wave yeah. just trying to sneak in. Well, no, oh, good let's combo see. to start off. Oh, that was not a good No, no, didn't sweet spot it and gets punished for it. That's what's wrong. All my ones is quick lead. Right that's, yeah, that's really good right there. with all of his moves, makes some smart choices. Ooh, but he gets grabbed. Oh, I think he's gonna die here. Yep, there it is. That's spike. Bread and butter, because his tether is an up B, not a, not a Z tether. So he has no invulnerability while he's doing his tether. So it's a free downer from Marth every time. As long as Marth executes it correctly. Wow. And there it is. Yet again. Marth with the legit combos over here. This oh, the up smash with the blue Pikmin doesn't kill. Very close. Very poor DI, but he still is. And good DI on that up there. Oh, and he gets through with the air dodge. Let's see if he can tack on any more percent. Got 13. Okay. Something that I don't like about playing Olimar myself, but that you notice all my players, is in moments where just nothing's like happening, you'll see a lot of time they'll throw a Pikmin off the side to cycle through and get the Pikmin that they want to do the move they want, like, which is something that I think takes a lot of paying attention, <laughs> which I don't do as much. I'm more of the run in and do stuff. Yeah. <laughs> I like playing Falcon. Falcon's exactly like that, so. But. Let's see if we can get anything converted right here. This is a very even game. This is a very even game. The neutral game, Olimar seems to have been winning the neutral game for the most part, but when Marth gets a grab, he can just extend it so far. And screwing up the anchor right there, and then up B. Ooh, nice up B. Gets the fire Pikmin. See what he can do. Um, the smart dancer, so that was good. I wonder if he counters Marth, like if it'll actually hit Olimar. I think it just depends on the move. Ooh, I mean, if you like, let's say Olimar goes quick in the market, I mean, oh. if it's Marth and I'm missing, it's just gonna be. Uh, I mean, if, if Olimar isn't raised, it hit him if he's not raised. Yeah. So. This is a close game. This is a very close game. Olimar's got the lead. Let's see if Marth can just land one tipper. There it is. He's dead. Let's see, close to 70 damage. You could tell that he was trying to DI sideways to get out of it, but it's yeah. not. If, if, on that percent, it's smartest to DI up, if I'm yeah. not mistaken. I don't remember. I guess it depends on the situation, but I don't know. Do you think it'd be better to DI up or to DI away? Probably, I would say probably up. But see, then again, I don't like. I wouldn't know. Yeah, no, I'd say in that situation, knows. definitely up, just because he was on the platform and he's so far to the side that exactly. if he goes sideways, it's like he probably won't get back to the stage. Yeah. Oh, can he? Oh. Let's see if Omar can clutch it out or if Martha's gonna have a legit comeback. Spacing those nares. Oh, smart. Oh, and the tipper. Oh. Omar's still alive. He's only got two Pikmin out though. If he gets away from the stage, he's dead. This is very worrisome for Olimar. Ooh, got the purple. Can he finish it? Ooh, well spaced up B. This is a very close match. This is a very, very, very close match. At a tournament, actually, the other, uh, it was a couple weeks ago in Smash 4. Oh, no, he's alive. Good DI. Death actually came back in the Smash 4 Grand Finals, for, like being way down, and pulled it back with Palutena. So he's definitely not somebody who's 
four into the comeback. This is the first person to get. See, they were smart. Granted, an up throw, I don't really do that, but. Oh, good shield. Grab. Good DI. Smart to DI away. Granted, Mars was bloody enough that I don't think he could have converted it to anything, but. Oh. Next person to get a hit is gonna win the game. Uh oh. Push stuff. Handle support. Nice. Oh. Good effort. Good effort, good game. He didn't have his pick room gathered, so he tried to up his sweet spot the ledge and it didn't snap to it, so he might have got a three for it smashed away. What a comeback from Mars. He's scared. That was pretty good. Mark is a pretty scary character, so that's for sure. Yeah. I'm curious to see what Olimar is going to pick. I think Zygo exclusively plays Olimar. I think he has a Bowser as a secondary, but I've never seen him whip it out in a tournament. He's just exclusively been playing Olimar. Against Marth, I wouldn't whip out a Bowser unless it was like too hot. It's because of the speed of things. Then again, Bowser has a super armor, so I mean, you don't know how yeah, I guess it just depends on the way you want to play. Most definitely. Who's playing it then? Oh, Fox. Fox has got a good lead. I have no idea who's playing on the floor TV. Well, Death has a. Damn, they do a run back to Smashville yet again. I guess I can say they're gonna have a smash in time. <laughs> it's kinda interesting, they both can chain grab each other. Ooh, good tech. I don't think he screwed up. Like a side B instead of an up B. Good tech, but unfortunately so much good. Getting the tipper on the white Pikmin. <laughs> I don't understand how the hell it works on the Pikmin. I know in Brawl you hit them like once and they die. Well, that's because he had like eight of them. In PM you only have four. And they have a lot more HP. I think it depends on the Pikmin. Grab. Oh, I went. I think he tried to go for a Dacus, but it didn't work out. Ooh, that was smart. He dashed back, but he missed the grab. I don't need a counter. That answers my question from early. <laughs> but this joint just not allow you. That was good. Marth really running away with this. He's spacing his aerials very well. Zygo's having a rough time doing anything. His movement's been solid too, so Zygo cannot really read what he's doing. So he's had a hard time. He's been getting hits in, no doubt, but he just can't really string much together. This time, good. Order with the yellow Pikmin. Pretty sure yellow Pikmin have the second most knockback. It's purple and then yellow. Pretty sure. But purple is the most dangerous. Oh yeah. Well, for I think for aerials, yeah. For smashes, I wonder. I don't really know. Between red and blue, I think blue has more knockback, but red does more damage. I don't know though. I haven't studied squad about all more. I know that he's got really good recovery. He has some really weird properties with his up where sometimes it just straight up won't work, which I don't know why, but just like how sometimes in melee, if you try and sweet spot the wedge on battlefield, it just won't work. Yeah. But I don't really like battlefield. Stadium is probably my favorite map, but I just. Either way. I mean, it's the same map in PM, pretty much. But, uh, well, actually, the transformation. Um, I just recently switched to Pikachu, so I don't really know how I feel about Pokemon Stadium and Pikachu. I think it just depends on the matchup. Right. Do it out there. Do it back. Let's see how it's, uh, 
it goes in this match anyways. Forward, uh, forward smash from uh, Mark just uh, tip the scale in Death's favor, but I mean... Oh, oh. Arrows right there. The aerial down B. Oh, going for the jab time we got crouch cancelled. King Ben should make it back. Nope. Made a poor decision with his. Is that the B or the down B? The one that split the it gives him like that extra foot jump. It's the down B. Oh, no, no, no. It's gotta be the B because the down B is the. Oh, you're right. Or he the, calls uh, the Pikmin. Yeah, it's the whistle. So the B is the B. Have you ever played Pikmin? I have not. It's pretty good, but I'm not really like, it doesn't, like interest me to play it. But it's kind of sad to say. Have you played it? Um, yeah, I, I bought Pikmin 2 like right as it came out, and I never played the first one. And I had a lot of fun with it, but like, of all things, my older brother, who's in college, oh, played geez. a bunch more. But, it's like, uh, 2 0. Oh. It's like, uh, that one, so, uh, next matchup's coming up shortly. Let's go play. Okay, now.